Hi, I'm Tony Adams, a defensive back here for the Illini football team and a political science student. I was wondering, is there anything you learned from your coaches that has helped you tackle tough issues along the way? Hey, Tony, yeah, thanks for the question, and uh, and I love watching you play, man. I appreciate uh, all that you're doing for the for the team. Um, yeah, what did I learn from the coaches? You know, one of the things I, I that's kind of stuck with me, and it may sound simple, but it, it really plays out in life as well as on, on the football field. Uh, so, you know, I was a defensive back as well, and, um, you know, one of the things we emphasized was never quitting on a play. And so we had these drills, and it'd be at the end of practice where, uh, they we would there wouldn't be an offense um, uh, practice offense against us a scout team offense against us we would just line up the coaches would uh, take a step back and he'd throw the ball somewhere down the field and we'd all have to pursue to the ball and you just never quit on a play never ever quit until you got to the to the uh, to the ball and that's one of the things that stuck with me throughout um, you know just to become an astronaut it took me 12 years uh, four applications I got three rejection letters and so never quitting on a play in football has trained Translated for me, never quitting on giving up on my dream of, of becoming an, an astronaut. I'm Doug Kramer Jr., offensive lineman for the University of Illinois football team and current grad student. Uh, my question for you today is if there's any lessons or experiences specifically from your teammates um, that really helped you develop your leadership skills that you still use today. Hey, Doug, yeah, thanks for the question. I love watching you play as well, and uh, thanks for all the years that uh, you've put in, and, and glad to hear you're coming back next year as well. A lot of times when you know we get named as captains on the team, um, sometimes you don't really know how to be a captain, and so I would encourage anybody that's in that situation, ask. Ask around, ask your coaches, ask your uh, uh, your friends, your peers, your, your, uh, you know, your parents. Um, there's there's a lot of advice out there and and i think it's important to to look at that and and learn and and then try and absorb as much as you can in terms of being a leadership hey mike uh, my name is blake hayes i'm a punter for the illinois football team and a kinesiology student uh, my question to you is if you could go back and provide some advice to your college age self what would that be? I've enjoyed watching you uh, you play and the difference that you've made in, in games. Uh, congratulations on just a, a wonderful career. Advice I would give myself is to be patient. Um, again, I, I tend to, I mentioned to be a little intense. Uh, I always want things to happen uh, faster than they're necessarily meant to happen. And, and so I think that's uh, one of the things I would, would certainly tell myself is uh, just be patient. Things, things will happen. Uh, when they're supposed to. You know, the other one is uh, something that, that has stuck with me, but I would uh, I would enforce that, and that is the never give up. Um, just keep, keep driving, keep uh, pursuing your dreams, whatever they may be, uh, whether it's with football and football after college, or at some point uh, football is gonna end and, and there's gonna be other things. So pursue those dreams and never give up on them. And, uh, and so I, I think, uh, you know, in general, I, I've been very fortunate and, and some of my dreams have worked out, but uh, I think there certainly could have been um, some uh, some improvements along the way. Hey, Mike, it's Josh Whitman. Just wanted to say, hey, thanks for everything you're doing. C continue to represent the orange and blue the way you do every day. And uh, only one official way to wrap this up, and that's with an ILL. I and I. Hey, Josh, thank you very much. It's great to be here. It's great to be with you. I can't wait to get back to Earth and, and come visit. Um, I, you know, the... There's just something special about the University of Illinois, uh, whether it's academics or whether it's the sports or whether it's just the, the student life there. Um, and, and so I, I just feel blessed to have been a part of it and I can't wait to get back and, and be around it again. Thank you all.